Hello and welcome along to part four of the Boxes Basic website with your host Robert Smith. In this video let's see how far we've come. Basically if we want to preview our file let's preview it in Google Chrome which is great like that. We've inserted images, we've styled an H1 tag, we've styled a paragraph tag and of course the uh, image tag will now apply to that second image as well. Okay, so let's look at a quick way of adding more content rather than having to code the whole lot again. I'm going to go into code mode like this. I'm going to select from the H1, the Johnny Famishon like this. I'm going to copy it. Command C like that. I'm going to come to the end of that block of code. Press return. Then Apple V for Victor to paste it in. And now I simply have to go in here and change the name. Now I know the second box's name is Glenn. Wade, like that, and I know that he is Boxer 2 inside that images folder, so I'm going to click on Boxer 2, like that, and we're going to type in here Glenn Wade, like that. Let's refresh that, and let's have a look at it. Let's have a look at it inside the browser in Google Chrome. Let's save that. As you can see now, we have Glenn Wade. Our H1 says that a paragraph tag, and a picture of young Glenn. Okay, fantastic. So let's go back out of there. Do the same thing again. I'm going to go after that, into that image tag, and Apple V to paste it, V for Victor. Now this time, I know I've got a boxer named Rocky Gatellari. Rocky Gatellari, like that. And I know he is boxer 3 inside the images folder and I'll just change this to Rocky Gatellari like that okay let's refresh that and have a look at that let's just check it out in the browser again preview in Google Chrome and we'll save that Glenn Wade Rocky Gatellari, new picture. As you can see, we can keep doing that, adding ad nauseum as many pictures as we like to make that uh, length. It doesn't really matter on a website how deep or how um, long the page is. The width is very important, but the depth, you can just keep adding content and it will. you can use the scroll to see your added content. Okay, so we've got three images, three boxes, and some text about them. Okay, that's it. That's the basic um, structure of how to make a website. We start off by managing sites. We then um, connect our HTML to our CWS file. We then add some content to our HTML file. We then style it using our CWS file. And then we cut and paste some content just to add more content quickly. Okay, that's basically it. In the next um, video, or the final video, we'll show you how to convert this into a portfolio for a young graphic designer.